It's Monday afternoon, and here's a quick video update for you as we, uh, we go through this beautiful Chamber of Commerce kind of a day. Well, you know, our our, our time is going to run out on these kind of days eventually, and boy, are we going to look back fondly on the first half of November when we get into the heart of winter. It's just a spectacular day. We have bright sunshine in Boardman along 224 and Market Streets. 64 degrees, 2.35, wind is calm. Our average high on this date is about 49, so... 15 degrees above the average. These temperatures, of course, a little more typical of late September rather than mid-November. Niles, again, bright blue skies, just not a cloud to be found this afternoon, and we're going to be in good shape for the rest of the day. These temperatures, again, across the board are between 60 and 65 pretty much everywhere. Might climb another degree or two before the afternoon is through. But we've got a big storm brewing out across the middle of the country. Now, this will produce blizzard conditions around Denver, Later today, tonight, and into tomorrow, severe weather is a concern out in the Plain States. First thing we're going to see is an increase in cloudiness tonight into tomorrow, but this rain that looks like it's heading right for us is actually going to run out of steam, and we're not worried about any rain here until uh, later Wednesday and into Wednesday night. And this could be a, a decent amount of rain. Now we could be talking about uh, half an inch or so. Some of our models show that much. So a, a decent slug of rain late Wednesday, Wednesday night, maybe early Thursday. And then some interesting things could be afoot as we head into the upcoming weekend. We might be talking about some frozen precipitation this weekend. So I'll break that uh, down for you in detail on weather for Weather Geeks this evening. We'll take a look at some computer models and show what the possibilities could be for not a big storm. But uh, still, after spending a few days in the 60s, chance of a little snow on the forecast uh, definitely uh, gets your attention. And that'll be again this weekend. And then next week, as we head into Thanksgiving week, could be pretty chilly. Nothing earth-shattering as far as cold, but certainly chillier than we've gotten used to so far this uh, this fall season. So all that coming up on Weather for Weather Geeks this evening, and you can check out my full seven-day forecast and lots of other stuff on 21 News this evening at 6 and 11. Have a great day.